Good morning, warriors, and welcome to weight loss motivation challenge number three. If you're new to the warrior community and don't absolutely like hate my face and are also interested in other weight loss motivation challenges, videos on mental health, weekly weigh-ins, all that jazz, then make sure to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to tap on that notification bell. All right, guys, so the quote for this morning is, if you want something you never had, you need to do something you've never done. And this quote just stood out to me this morning because I have a lot of non-scale goals that I'm really dedicated to and motivated to achieve that are things that I've never necessarily had or experienced, but I would like to. And it was just kind of one of those moments that just drove home that if I want to experience those things, I have to make a change. I think it's Einstein that said that the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over and over again, expecting a different result. And the fact is, is if I keep doing the same things that I've been doing for the past one, two, three decades, then things are never going to change. So again, if you want something you never had, you need to do something you've never done. And the journal prompt that I chose for today is, if there was one thing you wish you could do now or that you just wish you could do better, but you can't because of your current weight, what would that be? Or if you have more than one thing, then you know, go ahead and list them all down and it kind of goes back to those like non-scale goals, right? And your mini challenge for the day is going to start with number one. I want you to create a smart goal around the activity or whatever it is that you listed in your journal prompt. And a goal that is smart is specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time sensitive. Part two of your mini challenge is to now create a plan for how you're going to achieve that smart goal by breaking it up into baby steps or like baby mini goals. And then part three of your mini challenge is to start working on step number one today. So because today's journal prompt and mini challenge is a little bit more detailed than the last two motivation challenges, I thought I would share with you what my journal prompt and plan looked like so you guys can get a better idea. Now, the activity that I chose for my journal prompt response, um, I don't know. You guys should probably, if you've been watching me long enough, be able to guess it. And that is that I, I just want to be able to dance and not feel like held back and restricted and limited in my movements. Like that is my number one thing that I feel like my weight is holding me back on. And then my SMART goal, hold on, I gotta find it, where was it? Okay, my SMART goal that I created based on that activity was, by December 31st, 2021, I want to learn the choreography to BTS's Dynamite and be able to perform it with high energy and intensity, including all of the jumping moves. Now, obviously at my weight right now, being able to like really like put all of the energy and meet the intensity needed for a lot of these choreographies is just, I'm not saying I couldn't absolutely do it, but I would probably injure myself, especially with my bad knee. Like it, it would not be pretty. So that was my smart goal. And then like the baby step slash mini goals that I came up with were, lose 100 pounds this year by one, continuing to work out at least 30 minutes, six days per week to build endurance and lose weight, and two, continue following the OMAD intermittent fasting protocol and eating in a caloric deficit to lose weight. So that was like steps one and two that were all around like losing weight just so I feel a little bit lighter and freer and less restricted. And then step number three was 
Be more intentional about stretching my arms, legs, stomach, and back after workouts to increase flexibility because flexibility is extremely important for dancing and being able to learn choreography. And then step four is to learn and master the dynamite dance choreography by individual eight counts and not move on to the next eight count until I feel like I have mastered the previous eight count. And then to finish off the mini challenge today, I made sure that after I did my 10,000 steps this morning, I stretched for at least 10 to 15 minutes. All right, warriors. So that is it for weight loss motivation challenge number three. And make sure to comment down below and share what your smart goals are or even the plan that you've come up with. As always, thank you so, so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, let me know by subscribing and giving it two thumbs way, way up. And make sure to tap on that notification bell so you can join me next time. Bye, everyone. Mm -hmm.